Go ahead. Good boy, yes. So what I'm doing here is just building a bond with them, letting them know that I'm cool. We're, we're going to work. We're going to do some stuff. Just letting them know. Physical touch is a really good praise for a dog. I think this is the first time I ever met this dog, so, <laughs> you know, build a bond. But you guys did a good job about socializing. He's not afraid of people, which goes a lot. Um, the most important thing you can do is expose your dog to stuff at a young age where they are malleable, where you can mold them into what you want them to be. Um, one misconception that people have is, oh, I want my dog to be a protector, so I'm not going to let him see anybody. And then they start barking at everybody, and they're showing this defensive nature. And that's not necessarily what you want to do because everybody isn't a bad person and if you you don't want the dog to be thinking everybody's a bad person because when your grandma come over and they're doing that same behavior now nah, you look kind of foolish so you want to expose your dog letting them know that there are people you know out there in the world not necessarily let everybody pet your dog because everybody doesn't have good intentions so you just want to expose them as much as you can at a young age where you can still put them in a position to be successful and then if you want them to learn how to be protective uh protective protective <laughs> then you go and, and apply to the classes and we'll go on that another time <laughs> his classes to be clear man shit <laughs> <laughs> all right let's go oh shit <laughs> let's get in the sun a little bit what's his name macho macho yes oh, good boy good job yes yeah macho so motion is going to be your best friend oh, good boy good boy we're just marking that we got something for him. I'm not asking him to do any Try specific to keep him in the sun? Yes, sir. I don't want to keep playing with the light, that's why. You good? Oh, yeah, yeah. I got something for you, huh? Come here. here. Good boy. Choo, macho. Good boy, yes. Where you at? Where you at? Hey, macho. Yes, good boy. Oh, I give you belly rub. I give you belly rub, yes. Yeah. Building a bond, building a relationship with the dog is going to be the best thing that you can do. Because if they don't trust you, why are they going to follow you? Ready? Front. Good boy. So now we're going to teach an intro to recall where we're going to use the front command where I want him to come to me. Front. Good. He's gotten used to following me. Now we just want to mark the behavior. Front. Good. With the word and letting them know that there is something for them at the end. So now we're going to add another part. Front. Sit. Good boy. Had a boy. Yes, sir. Good, 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 good. Front. Sit. Good boy. Yes. Ooh, yeah, 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 yeah. One more time. Front. Sit. There you go, good boy, good boy. And on this time, we want to see if he's putting it together while I'm going to ask him to front. And without even telling him to sit, he's waiting there for the treat because we marked the behavior. And when the dog does what you want to do, quit, stop. Let them in on a positive note. A dog's always going to come back to something the way they left it. So if they were having fun, they did it how you wanted to, you didn't have to correct, you didn't have to repeat the command, end on that. Give them a break, throw a ball, put them up in the crate, but don't keep going until they start messing up. That's not what you want to teach your dog. You want them to understand that they are going to be successful when you put uh, give them that command. Well, there we go, people. You go. You want to do one more? <laughs> Let's do one more. Do, 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 do. Front. Good boy. Free. Yes, sir. <laughs> Good job. Good job. So that's just a little short session and that's what it takes. Mark the behavior that you want your dog to do, show them exactly what you want them to do and they're gonna be there for you.